Hey, and welcome back. Okay, so I will upgrade next turn. And declare probably. The bad thing is I can't go for Tata in like two turns. I will need three turns to reach it. It's a bit unfortunate. Because of the stupid jungle. Yeah. Not that great. Can go for this one though. Should I do that maybe? I won't need that many for it. Yeah, just go with a few guys for um, Eschnuna. And my main army will deal with with his army. Something like that should be should be good, right? Let's take that deal, why not? Eh, plenty of production. Now it has start whipping. Yeah, these waypoints are a little bit dangerous. I just whip everything pretty much. This guy should be, yeah, why are you not working for food, huh? Yeah, let's go on the front line and chop that. Okay, I don't think I will get more money than, than that, so I just take it. Even though it really hurts me. I won't need that many here. Um, I have five. Only five, what's going on? God. Okay, so that's eight. It's nine, and maybe a tenth. Okay, and the rest will focus on the on the western on the western front. Yeah, it's a bit disappointing with uh, upgrades. Yeah, but here's really really weak. Okay, now I have F11 even, so no big deal really. Might even look for capital, why not? Okay, I should be building farms now. That's a great general here, yeah? strangely enough. This guy should get the hell out of here, I think. Okay, well, I know what I'm dealing with. And I might sacrifice the workers. Don't want him to move into the jungle. Uh, that was saying that he only doesn't really matter. You won't get defensive bonuses if he moves into the jungle. Hmm. So maybe I don't care too much about that. Okay, any tech or tech wise, uh, no money, nothing to trade for really. Um. Yeah. Now we are still fighting Maya and the Russians. Can I bribe England? 
with me. Does he hate like everybody? He hates everybody. Huh? No, I, I won't bribe him, I think. Peter is busy. Budika hates him, so she won't take a bribe from him. In fact, nobody likes him, I think. No, so I'm completely fine. The upgrading thing was a bit disappointing. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, so what I'll do here, I will try to bait the army by moving a worker like, like that. And there's a good chance that he will take the worker out of the army and come in. And I just wipe him out pretty much. Tata. I might go for, for it actually with like... Don't think, don't think he will defend it as a thing. Uh, let's declare first and then think later. <sighs> okay, I have an extra fish now. Go like that. I have this guy, I have Oh, that was Archam. Maybe stays back for defense. Yeah, I mean, that should be enough, right? I mean, no matter how you look at it. Like 10 guys. Which means I'm I'm free to, to make another army. With about... Okay, so he actually can't reach me. If I move here, I am in position to come back if I have to, but I'm also in position to keep moving for Tatar if I'm, if I see a chance to, if I think it's good to do that. So, yeah, sounds good to me. The medic, I don't know. Yeah, he can also go here, I think. Promote a bit in case he gets any stupid ideas to hit me. No, we wouldn't want that. And I'm getting fresh guys. Yeah, so I'm not too worried about anything. Just tell everybody to build Crusius, it's a bit easier. Also, I can ignore the army for a while because he won't attack me. He will bombard the. He will bombard me first before he attacks. I mean, Vesity. So I'm feeling pretty secure with that. Also, I will capture gold and then I can upgrade more guys. So eventually I will upgrade everybody, I think. This takes a bit longer than I than I would have liked, maybe. Okay, again, no, no nothing really worth it. Maybe I can get money from my map. Uh, not, not that much. Peter? Yeah, he, Peter will pay me money for the map. So that's another guy I can upgrade. Churchill. 40. Yeah, could be worse. Again, he can't bribe anybody. Churchill has to be pleased, I think, and that's not going to happen. Yeah, I um, think, think I'm fine.
Hmm, he did not move her army in. And that's a bit... Don't know what he did. He can send a worker to check that out. Or a chariot. Hmm. Yeah, for some reason he is moving into this direction. Not sure what to make of that. But that's really a pretty pathetic army, if you think about it. So I don't know. Not too scared right now. I wouldn't want to give away the first strike to all the catapults that he has. But it might hurt a little bit. Try to bait him again, maybe bait him to to come back with the worker. Yeah, so what do I do with that information? I have a movement. Um, you know what would have been smart? If I went here with my four workers and chopped that jungle and foreign territory. That would have been smart. I didn't do that. I think I'll keep moving here and... Try to take that, maybe maybe do a, a ceasefire after that, something like that. Okay, longbowman. No, pikeman. Huh? Ah, so he will give me that guy then. Well... Not even wounded, huh? Nice to be lucky. Ha! Ah, take that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Couldn't let me have that one. Yeah, I think I'll ignore that worker if he's not. Not really valuable. Uh oh, okay, we have a Buddhist missionary. Who built the AP actually? Maya. So that's like Christianity, right? No, it's actually in, in Buddhism? Wait, I'm kind of confused now. It's in Buddhism, why isn't it in Buddhism? Must be in Buddhism. How can it be? Yeah, there's a danger because if he is going to convert everybody into Buddhism, they could make a could call a, a vote for diplo victory. So a way to counter that would be to close borders with that guy right now. So he can't convert me. Um, yeah, I can't risk that. I mean, he has open borders with... Um, no, he doesn't. Maybe it's not that dangerous, actually, because he cannot convert Boudicca in any way. So I shouldn't be too paranoid. Yeah, Boudicca won't be converted. I think. He's trying to convert me and I don't like that. But he would drop the cautious if I if I closed my borders with him. That's the other thing. Yeah, it's um Yeah I close borders, I don't like it. 
and maybe I'll gift him gift him something so he mm, paper so he likes me a bit more again ah screw that don't need him to like me as long as he doesn't get too pleased with Hammurabi because then he could get bribed against me and that wouldn't be nice but until that happens I'm pretty fine I think Yeah, well. Okay, I move like that. I have uh, an idea. I take Tata. The, the culture goes away. And I hit him in the open. It's kind of my plan right now. It can work, I think. Theory. Yeah, why not? Okay, I did whip already. Nothing I can do here. Okay, let's continue. Holy shit. Where two workers? Um, she is plotting. She can't plot it, pleased. I also give it to her. It's, it's pretty. Oh, she declared on Hammurabi. When? I didn't even notice that. I don't have to give her that in that case. She's pleased, she doesn't plot it, please. Oh, it catapult. What a bastard, huh? No. Not sure not sure where he even came from. Ah, he moved back. Okay, good. He's being an idiot. I have to bait him. Bait him here. There is no road here. So he can't do anything against me taking Tartar now. It has, yeah, it's pretty. I don't think she was even plotting. She just declared like one turn. Oh, that's going pretty pretty well. Get rid of a damn cul damn culture. He used the great artist here. Like an idiot. Uh, I think I could hit him right now, man. Um, I have nine guys. Ten. Eleven, twelve. Fourteen. And he has what? Eight elephants. I'm going to flank the catapults into oblivion. I have even more. Yeah, I think I'll do it. Just punish him. Just punish him right here. I uh, only have to pay attention that she doesn't actually capitulate him too quickly. Oh yeah. Elephants are a little bit annoying to fight against. And I think I can deal with it. I can even use the elephants to attack the horse archers. It's kind of funny. I can use the horse archer for the catapult here. And his catapults are getting flanked pretty hard. Oh yeah. Mm. 
<laughs> Just went kapoof. Just like that, hmm. That was pretty funny for sure. Could kill that guy or just ignore him. Yeah, still won't talk to me. Okay, the medic will probably have to be here. We can make a second great medic now that I think about it. I think it's a good idea actually. If I want to be fighting at multiple locations. Yeah, so this guy can be here. Um, could use a healer over here right now. Maybe upgrade that guy. Because he's close and I want to keep pushing and he is right here, so it's kind of convenient. Get reinforcements in and next turn I continue to go for Shushan. Automate a few guys so they can they can build roads. As far as I'm concerned, and maybe one worker can go here and follow her army, make sure she doesn't take him out too quickly. Okay, good, um, nice start for sure. Might go for Churchill after that. He's a bit adv more advanced than the other idiots. And yeah, he's the biggest threat. If I take him out, well, then it's pretty much over. And I know that Hammurabi doesn't have much more now. Yeah, there's no counter attack. Nothing. Ah, here's her army. Little trick you can use. Uh, I want to follow her army, right? And you you can now check the turn order. So the turn order is from top to bottom, which means after I do my turn, Hammurabi moves first, then Churchill, then Peter, then Boudicca, then Pekel. And that's important because if I put my worker on this army right now, right, I do it like that, and I end my turn, Hammurabi will, will move first, and this army will still be in this position, so he, he can't take my worker. If it was, if it was in the you know in the opposite way, with Budika moving first, it would mean Budika moves, my worker is um, exposed, and Hammurabi can pick him off. But since Hammurabi moves first, he can't do that, and so I can just park that worker here, and he's completely fine. And nobody can take him out or anything. Kind of nice. Nope. Oh, got my tile back. Alright, let's go for Shushan. Oh shit, didn't mean to do that. No, no. Horse Archer, really? Okay, uh, it's Flatland. Uh, only 20% cultural defense. Should be doable. Especially if I move a few more guys over. Now here I want hmm. 
Maybe these guys can't really move. Unfortunately. I will go for Nipper. Hmm. We'll put, we'll put like one defender like that. Then this guy can join here. And surely I can move this horse archer here for defense. Can't upgrade. Sure, I can upgrade an elephant, bro. Ah, look at the scout here. I think I'll ignore him. It's free experience points, and it's only a, it's only a distraction, really. Yeah, I don't think he can take it back. I mean, he doesn't have anything. He shouldn't have anything. That you never know. So maybe I should make sure and just. Well, if I, if I do that, surely I'm fine. Yeah, come on, don't tell me I'm not fine. That would be very strange. Okay, so these guys can focus on Nipper. It's five, that's not enough. This guy maybe. Yeah, they have to heal kind of. And loop again. This guy can join. No, he can't join. Damn. It's disappointing. Yeah, I might have to wait for one turn, apparently. Oh, that's fine. Where's my medic? Here, yeah, okay, good. Really? How can you be unhappy, huh? Hmm. There's nothing I can do, apparently, to... Huh. Ah, he has a statue of Zeus, that bastard. Where? In Babylon, of course. Uh, what a prick, huh? Well, uh, luckily I have... I can deal with that. Um, can move this warrior here, for example. I don't want to move a Quirrosir back, I mean... They have to be fighting and not... Babysit my... My cities. Alright. England not plotting, that's an important part here. I can deal with Babylon. Yeah, that's, it's fun pikeman really, it's, that's a, pikeman is a bastard, but, um, the horse archer is a joke, a maceman. Yeah, but it's, it's, um, I have six guys against five, it's not going to work. So I might as well chill a bit. Oh, she took out his iron, nice. Not sure if, if he has another iron. Yeah, he, he does. Yeah, still nice move. Mm. Yeah, pretty good odds though. Shouldn't be too hard. Ah, free pike mana. Yeah, that's no match for me. Okay, got that. 
Now the rest might want to heal. That's my damn medic again, huh? I need like even more medics, dude. Alright, let's um, move into position for Nipper. I need to build a road here. That's not that important. But, uh, okay, I can't reach that anyway, so... Well, maybe I can. The damn scout, man. I'm gonna kill him and move like that. No. I only have one big city, so I only feel it here, really. The rest I'm whipping anyway, so I don't care if I have 10 war variants. Doesn't make a difference. Okay, now that should be enough. No matter how you look at it. Oh, you might kill the workers, huh? Yeah, but maybe he won't. Especially if I... Damn it. Okay, so I can't reach that, apparently. I can move this guy like that to protect my workers. Yeah, these guys over here um, might go for Borsipa. I think I'll let him keep Opus. When I capitulate him, makes makes it possible to hit England a bit easier. So I'll just ignore that and go for Borsipa. And yeah. Okay, this guy is here. This guy has to do nothing. Now this elephant could... Yeah. yeah, let's move out. What the hell? Oh, actually I have... Yeah, I can move this guy further. In that case. She's not moving forward, that's even better. I think she's upgrading, um, that would be my theory. Yeah, but who knows, they do strange, strange stuff. Yeah, my economy is kind of a piece of crap right now. The largest. Ah, I captured a, oh god, I captured a city with Buddhism. So that whole thing with closing borders didn't, yeah, didn't work out. Uh, well my vote doesn't really count. I have like five, five votes. So I'm going to vote for Diplo points and getting Churchill to please might be, might be worthwhile. It's not going to make a difference between him winning or not. I think he will win anyway because he has the most cities in Buddhism. He is going to win because of that. And I don't need to diplo points with Pekel, so I, I vote Churchill. Hope that makes sense. I don't, don't understand though why the AP is in Buddhism. Oh, they're not fighting anymore. Yeah, pretty easy. And 
and a bit of luck and I can take Babylon. Would she capitulate already? He's not, he's not talking. And Boudicca still not moving. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think I go for England first because Boudicca doesn't even have a civil service and it's like 800 AD. Yeah, she's alone. She doesn't have anybody. Uh, easy target, pretty much. Oh, I can't reach that, you're kidding me. Yeah, I might have enough anyway. It's on flatland, I think. Flatland. How hard can that be? Uh, a few catapults. Might want to move out of range of, from these bastards. Move here, maybe. Yeah, I won't be crossing a river. Um, pretty sure about that. I might not even have to take Borsapa or anything else. Take the capital and he might he might cave in at that point. But just in case. I don't, don't think I'll upgrade that guy. And maybe new ch new waypoint, huh? Let's go for Shushan. Since I am going for England. And after that. Yeah, I'd rather make sure I take Babylon for sure. Uh, and I suppose these guys can start. Well, actually, no, they can't. They are too weakened. Then again, he won't have much. So I might have luck with. going right now. Who knows? Yeah, okay, this guy's just um just wait one turn. Medic. I move from here. More whipping or chill a bit. Yeah, maybe I'll chill a bit. But here I won't chill. Mm. And here size nine. It's um, it's way too much. But these ones I leave alone for a bit. Don't know. Okay, theology. Hmm. I can get that from Hammurabi in the capitulation deal. No need to give paper away. Yeah, Churchill has gunpowder and it's being a being a pain in my ass, I think, so I'll take him out. Oh yeah, I have marble now. Who cares? One thing to consider is once I capitulate Hammurabi, Boudicca won't really like me too much. So that might be an argument for going after her actually. Since I don't want to get backstabbed from her by her. I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, just go for it, I think. 14. Don't count the horse archer, don't count the swordsman. So essentially one pikeman and two longbow. Yeah. 
Oh, nice. Ah, yeah, she's, she has knights now. Ah, she really hates him. Yes, it's a, it's a good question, definitely. What to do? These guys can heal, and I have to take one more, I think. Ignore this one. A cat, maybe, or boss supply some flatland. Maybe he'll capitulate now since I killed the catapult. No. No. And maybe this pikeman, I might have might kill him now because he. Uh, he might be going to the front line here. I, I don't know that. Um, yeah, maybe I'll ignore him. Who knows? Oh god, I can't even reach it in two turns. Uh, disappointing, definitely. Does he have here? I think I'll take out that iron of his. I can move one more forward, I suppose, and check out what he got. Ah, that's a bit too much. Unfortunately, this guy I don't know. Just um, think I'll promote a few guys to strength combat three. Might be the most useful thing to do. Who knows, next turn he might um, give in. And my workers do have some work to do. Um, I shouldn't automate them too carelessly. I mean, not all of them at least. But then again, Churchill, okay, then, yeah, he does like him actually. I was going to say that he doesn't like my vessel as well. Yeah, but, but he does, that bastard. No, you know what that means? He could pierce a vessel to Churchill. Unless he doesn't bribe it, pleased. He doesn't. No, so he can't, he can't vessel to Churchill. Good to know. Boudicca, Churchill, uh, but but if Churchill, I should find the army that he that he surely he surely got. Don't know where, but I know he does have it, uh, and I 
don't have open borders with him. Yeah, it kind of feels like I should be going for Boudicca, really. It makes more sense in a way. In many ways. So I'll, uh, I'll take that choke po um, waypoint. Yeah. I know about Boudicca, I know how much, how many guys she has, I know where they are. And that makes her a pretty good target. And she hates my vessel. So she might come for me. I'm her only neighbor. So it's like... It would be perfect if she moved her army here. I capitulate him. Yeah, but she will get teleported. Yeah, never mind. But catching it in the open would be pretty good. Come on, you bastards, capitulate. Oh, man. I go here, maybe he will move a few guys from Bossipa to a cap because I'm threatening it. Medic. Yeah, he'll one turn here for full health bar and then next turn I take that and that, that should be it. I mean, there's no way he doesn't give in after that. Medic. Yeah, just heal, why not? Oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, I can pillage that. Ten gold, why not? Better than nothing. Yeah, I could share some food with my capital, actually. Eat more guys. I won't go broke. Somehow I'll, I'll be doing fine. Uh, capture money. Selling stuff. Oh, hey. Let's, let's do that. Guilds? Do I need guilds? No, not really. Here, yeah, granary first. All right, let's um take him out. Come on. Ah. Hmm, okay, Budika is right here. But if I let her capture that um, Hammurabi will give in to her, so I, I should just do it now. LSR, I don't care about that. Go through religion, you punk. And the money would be good. Maybe drama as well. For good measure. That way Churchill will like him even more. 
Oh, but Churchill doesn't like me, unfortunately. Sheep. Give him ivory, the poor bastard. No. And I would almost just right away declare on Boudicca, almost. But now Churchill doesn't like me that much either, because I closed my borders with him. It doesn't have to be an issue though, because Boudicca can't bribe him. Boudicca has no friends. Pakal maybe, but she doesn't have any tech either to give Pakal. So... Um, Peter. That would be interesting, kind of. But Churchill would pretty much kill him. It would be nice to go for Churchill before he gets to Grenadiers, which he might be might be going for. And Boudicca is so far behind, you kind of want to delay that and take her out later. But if I go for Churchill now and it leaves me open to a to a backstab of some kind. I don't like that too much. Bo saying that I could back from her for ten for one gold and I would be fine. And I wonder how much Churchill has in terms of units, but it can't be too much. Yeah, what if I just declare on, on Churchill right now? Um. I have no information about Churchill. I don't know how much he has, where he got it. Though my guess would be on the border somewhere, right? I want to go for Churchill, I can't help it. I deal with Boudicca somehow. I don't want to go for her at the moment. Just don't. Guy with vision would be good. Anybody? Okay, apparently I can't. Yeah. It's okay, he can't have that much. And this worker will follow her army. Also, I have workers here not doing anything, I think, yeah. They could be... They could be spies. Of some kind. Yeah, I'll just go here. Just go for it, I don't care. Should work out. Yeah, 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 everybody. And the statue of Zeus is now no longer a factor, so I can now whip up more again. And yeah, let's go for it. Optics. Hmm. And if I go for Churchill, I can bribe Peter on on Churchill. Um, oh yeah, AP resolution. 
gonna force me out of the war. I can defy that crap, I don't care. Yeah. Yeah, and he got printing first with Punk. Might be going straight for the nasty stuff. Uh. Yeah, take him out now. That's my opinion. At least hit him. Do damage. Just do that, I think. Lots of guys will reach 10 experience now. Go here for a road. Now I just would like to know where he is hiding the army. of important Newcastle maybe who knows Follow her army. Yeah, go for it now. I have to push before he gets to rifling. If he's going for rifling, who knows? He, he might not go for it. I'd rather do something about him right now. Budika. Some education for printing press, maybe. They're not gifting Hammurabi back the stuff that he that I captured from him. From him, I think I want to use it myself. Okay, I would, would like to to go right now, if possible. But only if the army is not in freaking Cherokee. I mean, where could it be? Realistically. Maybe I declare next turn, I don't know. I can hit him now. Right now. Where could it be? I'll well, just declare and find out. He will move it into. into position. And I can bribe Peter. 
Yeah, forget about printing press. Uh, let's get to that. Don't mind giving him education too much. Peter, I wonder if he will go for it if I... It might not be enough. He might be like close to that. Okay, I think I will, will wait one more turn. And then I'll do it with nationalism. It's definitely going to be enough. Yeah, so okay, okay, one more turn. Just get in the position. I want a road here. And then I can move my scout. It makes a bit more sense, I think. Where's the medic? Okay, like one of one or two more turns, I think. Just want to know what he got. Man, he didn't have that much food, huh? Kind of struggling here a little bit. Yeah. Oh well. Now I go for it. Keep an eye on on Budica. Yeah, Forge here is almost not really worth it. Nah, go for it anyway. Okay, I know Peter will go for it. Once I declare, mm, paper won't be enough, right? Okay, let's do it like that. Optics? Mm. No, nah, I don't need that. That's good enough, I think. What about Pekel? Would he go for Churchill? Doesn't like me enough. Now can I back from him again, maybe? Okay, so he could be bad against me. But he can't even... Okay, he can reach me, actually. Yeah, we'll worry about that later. Straight away I can capture Dover. Maybe I'll leave that to Hammurabi. It has a strong longbowman. I would only die. Oh, no, I wouldn't actually. Yeah, it's, it's cut off anyway from his empire. So it's good enough if I just tell him to go for Dover. And myself, I could... Okay, where's my scout guy? Let's build a road here first. Okay, that's my scout guy. He can figure out what's going on. Maybe. Newcastle looking pretty... pretty weak. Cherokee. Okay, well... Pfft, I don't, don't know, man, but... 
I won't think too much about that, I'll just go for it. Four, that's eight. It's twelve, it has to be enough for Cherokee. Newcastle, I'm a bit more. I don't know, the army, that can even be. I mean, I don't, I don't know. His worst enemy might have been. No, Budica was the worst enemy. Hmm. Yeah, it's a, it's a mystery. Let's take Liverpool for first and then think later. I'd also raise it if I was a bastard. Okay, Pikeman. Can I reinforce that or not? Okay, I can. So I can take that fight. Good. But this army can't reach me in, in one turn. So... No matter where it is. Shouldn't be too afraid. And the rest, well... Go for Newcastle, I think. Maybe here. Maybe here, so I can threaten both. No, yeah, why not? The rest can heal for one turn and choppy. Worker should be close, so I, so I can build roads where needed. If needed. I can also block that pikeman from going into the into the city. The best you can do is take out my guy. But I can prevent that by defending him a bit better. And uh, these guys, I don't know. Move here and these two does just uh, defend the worker. Budica not plotting yet. Water poison or what? Uh. Oh, I also lose my trades with Pakel, I think, and with Peter. Not a big loss. Uh, I lose the gems, I think, but it's it's okay. Yeah, I have plenty. Keep whipping, and everything should be fine. Babylon, Slender Revolt. Babylon, what does he have? Let me check that. Academy, the two great generals, um, Statue of Zeus, Borsopper Head, Great Library, nice. Parthenon, does he have a Parthenon? Yeah, in a cat, okay. So he, he kept that. But that's okay. Oh, no, I'm bleeding cash. Took my worker. And the pikeman moved. Yeah, sure, dude. You can have a die. So what happened? Church, church, will touch my hole. Nice. Bastard. Uh, information would be good. Hmm. Maybe chop a few. Oh, that worker moved into bad position. Oh, 
Okay, well, first things first, let's take out. Ah. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Pinch. Alright, let's. Oh god. City garrison free musketmen, yay. Even more important to hit him before he gets grenadiers or. You know what, Boudica? For the sake of our friendship, take that. Yeah, she likes me. A bit more. Okay, well. <laughs> he won't talk yet. Uh, the danger is that. I run into his army and he just completely wipes me out. I think I'll risk it. That's my vision guy. Ah, okay, well, just. No, you're so strong, guys, I think. New castle is pretty likely to defend it. I mean, few longbowmen, no musketmen, so not too hard. Nice, yeah, it's really worth it to have a city, to have a strength guys with combat three. Like it better than settling the great generals and takes too long to pay off. Getting a benefit immediately is usually better. Okay. Now, of course, they still die, but they do. They also do more damage, on average. So it's 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 worth it, I think. I don't see the army anywhere, so I keep it. And now I'm kind of inclined to do that. Not here. Just kind of running out of. Not here. So where can it be? If one elephant here, I think I'll leave that guy to. To Hammy. Yeah, I don't know, but I think I'll go a bit, a bit more defensive now. I checked here already. Uh, there's nothing, dude. And once I can make a ceasefire, I have a get out of jail button. So if I if I run run into him and can't get can't get away, I can I can cease fire and retreat and it's yeah, it's pretty good. Okay, free worker. Well, I can't can't really say no to that. Yeah, use the workers as, as scouts, I think. It's, um, I need to know what's going on. Very important. Maybe I'll even defend this worker. I don't know. If I'm that desperate. For knowledge. Yeah, maybe not.
Okay, another guy. Oh yeah, I am imperialistic, so I get some get some quicker. It's also nice. Okay, but I think it's a good time to take a break. So thanks for watching, and next time, hopefully I'll finish him off.